Okay, good morning. This is the Monday after the weekend where we were doing all that work trying to get this stuff all uh, prepped and ready to go. My kid is now well again and back in school, so just continuing this storyline and trying to wrap it up here. Um, yeah, I want to be putting in a ton of work on these Lego bins today, uh, but all that work we did last week uh, really seemed to spark some sales. I don't know if like people just got paid on Friday and then, you know, spent their money on mine and therefore I got some of that money or if, you know, the extra work I put into posting stuff somehow boosts the algorithm. I don't know. People pretend to know this stuff, but I don't think you can actually know it. All this to say, we uh, got a lot of sales going out today, like 15 on eBay and three on Bricklink. So let's pull some orders and one on the viewer sales. So let's do that first. So this is going out to Timothy. He got all of this cool stuff right here. Uh, normally, when I see somebody buy a big bunch of stuff, I try to guess what they're making. Like either they buy a bunch of train parts, a bunch of plants or something, but I have no idea what you're working on. So here's just a little land speeder for you. Thanks, Timothy, it's on its way. As always, uh, you guys buying something is, is not expected at all, but it's always extremely appreciated, even if it's just a small value order. I just appreciate it so much. So thank you, Timothy. And here are the other two Bricklink orders. So first set of instructions I've ever sold. So that's cool. Uh, they got just kind of random bits and pieces here. Must be trying to complete some couple different sets. And then this person, as far as I know, neither one of these reviewers, they got a Bo-Katan. <laughs> one of those, don't know why you would order just one, but hey, their projects, not mine. And then, those guys and then that guy. Bo-Katan, as far as I know, is the first sale out of that big $500 buy I did at the start of the month. And she went for $26, I think. So we just need more of that to happen. Okay, let's do some eBay orders. One, two, three. These belonged to a GI Joe plane I had when I was a kid. And the plane is long gone. I was cleaning the stuff out of my parents' house, but I found the missiles again and somebody picked them up. So either because I'm an idiot or I like to torture myself at this dinosaur cell, but I didn't write down where I put it. So hopefully I find it relatively quickly. We're just gonna keep the train going though. These Hoka's right here sold. And if you remember from a couple videos back, I bought them for a doll hair. And you may also remember there was another set of shoes I also bought for a dollar from the same house. And that one sold already. So 35 and 25 out of $2. This set of shoes is in storage. Wow, that was a tongue twister. So I gotta go get that later today, but those sold also. I've had them for a long time. I don't even remember when and where I got them. I might have got them at the unique thrift store, which probably means they were a little pricey, but they're gone now. I'm a little mad at myself about the dinosaur. It's a new item. It should be obvious where it is. I just didn't put a SKU number on it for some reason. Annoyed. I am confident it will turn up, but let's get to the good stuff now. This sold this morning, so I'm just gonna grab that because it's easy. And we just put that together in the last video. Uh, the city tow truck sold, which we also talked about recently. Nice to see stuff go quickly. Anakin Starfighter sold. Look at that, oh, it's just clearing space. I love it, right there, sold. And Anakin should be in there. Yep right there and then this sold this wasn't this was all part of that $150 buy video so you can see we're doing very well on that this I picked up at a thrift store with some other stuff and the sale of this one paid for all the other stuff I got I just got to put the other stuff together still as cool as big builds are like this I love these mini scale architecture type builds. I just think they are so cool looking. Went to pull another order and found the dinosaur. So we'll get that packed up ASAP. All 
<clears throat> this is what I meant to grab. That came out of the giant Salvation Army haul we got, I think it's a little over a month ago now. Maybe two months ago. So that is all profit. We'll go ahead and grab this one because it's easy. And then I'm going to have to pack some stuff to make room. That I bought for a buck at an estate sale. And I picked up two for a dollar each. And the other one sold already. Okay, back on track. Get this out from back here. Nice. E.T. mug. This is on its way out. Bought that for 50 cents. So not a lot of money, but for 50 cents, I'll do it. Kingdom Hearts. Probably came out of a bulk buy, so I have no idea what that, what that was purchased for. Looking for Ninjago 71770. Is that it? I can't read it. I think that's what that says. Yes, that was it. And while I had the step ladder out, I went ahead and grabbed that. There we go. That's the day. Alrighty, so other than that pair of Heelys, we are set to go. Shipping wise, that round of sales this weekend helped out a lot but we still need to make up quite a bit of ground from that awful awful week of just sales not happening uh, just to kind of give you an idea of some numbers on the 16th it was a five dollar and 44 cent day in sales and then an 86 dollar day this is after fees and shipping the 18th was a 10 dollar day like it was just a string of bad bad days coupled with uh, me not being able to work as much because my kid got sick. So I, I'm not blaming my kid. I don't want to give that impression, but it's a fact of life. Uh, the 20th was a $48 day. Like the minimum I want to hit every day is a hundred. And I just had this big old string of not doing that. So what does that mean? That means I got to really focus in on this today and tomorrow, Monday and Tuesday. This stuff came from a yard sale that um, you guys haven't seen yet. Absolutely have not seen yet. Uh, it should be out soon though. But I'm gonna get this all posted really as fast as I can to get to work on this. And then this also came out of that same yard sale video. Just start listing some pops. I'm trying not to get too excited, but I think this is a super rare convention one only. I can only find them in box. I don't know anyone who successfully sold one used, but it glows in the dark, which is cool. I can't get it dark enough in here to do that, but trust me, it glows in the dark. And then Reptar is a rare one as well. So we're gonna get posting. That's what we gotta do. Oh, also these three auctions are going on and in value so far, the three have accumulated $65. If that could hit like $200 total between those three by the end of tomorrow, that would be a huge help. So fingers crossed that that happens. All right, so this is one of those things that'll help out immensely is getting this listed. I had to order the parts because I couldn't find them. And uh, let's open it up. And I have another shipment that should arrive today or tomorrow, but... Um, there's parts for another build going on that I need to, uh, that looks like a cracked arm to me. Maybe it's just a dirty, it's only a white arm though. I'm not going to get upset. Okay. Let's, uh, finish this up. Oh, what I was saying is, is I try to like let parts I need build up and then I'll do like a big purchase. So I, I have a couple sets that I'll be completing in the next day or two, depending when another when the other package shows up. Oh, we got a broken clip here, y'all. Yep, I gotta, re I gotta replace that clip. There we go. Snug as a bug. And let's get this posted. Cleared off the top of this. Officially posted nine items and got rid of stuff that just wasn't worth posting. 
either the sell through rate was really bad or it just wasn't worth as much as I thought it was going to be. But that's okay, we get into this stuff for super cheap. Uh, we're gonna do some Lego now. This is like 99.9% .9 done. It's just missing the motorcycle. And I am very tempted to just substitute this red one for the orange one and say, and just disclose that in the eBay listing because it's not a valuable set. However, I'm getting ready to, we have seen multiple, multiple parts for this one while we were working on the other Minecraft stuff. And I have seen this car multiple times while working on other stuff. So we're just gonna work on this. And if we find the orange motorcycle, awesome. If not, we will move on with our life. Okay, that took a little longer than I wanted it to. Turns out the dark red, I don't have a ton of spares of. So I had to do more digging than I actually wanted to. And we're still missing some things. Uh, missing the face covering for that guy. We got to find these torches that go on the bridge. And we're missing the pig torso. But otherwise, I think we're all here. Uh, one, two, three. Yeah. One, two. Yep. Cool. Uh, did find both gold swords. And then this guy, we just got to find the right windshield. So, because I'm looking for an orange motorcycle, looking for stuff for the Ender Dragon set, and I gotta find these last few things, I think it's worth it for me to just sit down for an hour and look for this stuff and, you know, keep pulling stuff that looks interesting that I might need later and uh, do some organizing. Like, I think, it might be worth it to me to like this set, this box is mostly half complete sets. So if I pull them out of these other bins, put them in here, and then uh, these start get organized by color just a little bit. I don't need to go all out on it, uh, but I think that'll be, I think that'll be worth the time just to get to know where stuff is. I also need to make time today to uh, edit all these videos I have. Uh, I have two workday videos, this video, and a yard sale video I gotta edit. So there's always something to do and uh, it doesn't get done unless I do it. So thank you all for watching. I hope this was educational. Sure, I hope you enjoyed it. How about that? And I will catch you all next time. Bye.